everyone. Today we're playing a special game from my memories. This is a Sega Genesis game called... Well, as you see it's about dolphins, but it's called Echo the Dolphin. This is pretty much my childhood. This was probably one of the most played games I've ever played in the Sega Genesis. And right now it's doing demos. It's an interesting... It's a very interesting concept for a game. But Oh god, I forgot my controls! Uh, I forgot my controls! Oh. Oh, arrow keys, I have to move the dolphin around. Ace for echolocation. Oh, just talked about the dolphin. The marks on your head look like the stars in the sky. Why, thank you, young sir. Echo, if we breathe air, why do we leave beneath the waves? This is a good question from a dolphin. This dolphin's too smart for us! Get out, bros! But yes, pretty much. You see, you're just a simple dolphin swimming around, enjoying life as a dolphin. And so if you press an old echo location, you can see that there's... What's going on around you? Like, there's two dolphins, there's fish. You have to eat the fish to survive. And I should stop delaying and actually start playing the game, but I want to just... Let you know. Okay, there's more dolphins, nobody cares. Eating fish. Okay, those that's Oh, they're rocks. That's mean rocks. I don't know how that worked, but okay. But onwards to the show. Pretty much you normally have to ask about what you have to do. You have to use your echolocation to talk to the others. Yes, we already figured that out there, Mr. and Mrs. Dolphin. Sing to the shelled ones and they will heal your wounds. That is always good to know. Because all the dolphins at the beginning tell you what to do. Mostly. Uh... I know what I'm supposed to be doing by trying to find the right dolphin so that everybody else knows. Yes, we know that already. Where is it? Oh, there's one in the... How high in the sky can you fly? Yes, that's the one I want to find. So pretty much... You go to the bottom, and also there's a speed button which makes you charge. But pretty much you hang out at the bottom here, turn around, and charge! Suddenly this happens! Something's not right. Where are all the fish? Where are all the dolphins? What happened? All that happens was crazy spooky things in the sky while I was in the air. And suddenly all my friends and family disappeared. They all abandoned me because I had funky stuff on my forehead that looks like stars in the sky. And also now, you'll see I have an air and health bar. The air bar will go down when I'm going to be not able to breathe. And of course the health bar goes down when you get damaged. Oop! Almost ran into a jellyfish, that'd be bad. Suddenly great winds of water. I feel like I should be pressing another button. Nope, it's just the same button, okay. Suddenly great winds of water. Oh, see my air bubble went down, so then I just go up. And I'm healed! Well, then I got a gulp of air. Yay! Oh. Mm -hmm. 
Don't touch the jellyfish. But did you see that? That was amazing. I could jump out of the water and perform epic tricks because I'm a dolphin. And dolphins do that shit. Oh god, jellyfish! Ow, ow. Jellyfish hurt. And see those spikes? We don't touch those spikes because they hurt. But fish heal you up if you eat them because they're delicious. Ow! I'm surprised I didn't get damaged by that. Okay, it's more fish. That means I have to probably go down more. Yes, definitely. And I'm going to die of lack of air. Ah, oh, there's an air pocket ahead of me, and what I'm supposed to be finding. Air! So now I go talk to this orca who won't kill me. Ah, I'm stuck inside you. Uh, there we go. Uh, still stuck. There we go. I know not what has happened to your pod. Perhaps the big blue will help you. You must travel past the under caves to find him. And then he leaves. And what I did right- oh. He leaves and then returns. That that's sort of it. The guy's just like, oh, I'm gone. No, I'm here. I'm here to torture you. Oh, ow! <laughs> when I first started playing this game, actually, as a kid, I did not know you could actually damage the jellyfish, and so I died a lot due to them. Ow! Jellyfish everywhere! Ow. Get. Oh, there's a dolphin below me. Let's see what he says. Winds of water pilled me here. Winds of water! That's just an interesting wording. Ah, that's where I need to go. And see, when I touched that diamond before, not that diamond, but that giant gem before, it means that I could get past here, because if I didn't, then I'd just be doing that forever. Ow. But now, because of that, I just use... Not that button, but if I use that good location with just the button right next to it, it just knocks it out of the way so I can continue on. Bye! The Undercaves! And there's a code to go to the Undercaves if you guys want to just be bums and be like, nah, I'm not gonna get very far. Steal my cheat codes that I hard earned really hard. Worked really hard for. <laughs> A deep maze of caverns with no surface to the dry side. Songs of the sea sing of great danger in this place. Okay, we can continue on now, right? Yes? Don't tell me you froze. Because that would suck. Let me go! Okay, no, this is actually where I died a lot, was right here. Because I- OW! And I'm still die right there. Oh, need to grab- OW! Stop it! Oh, that's the bad one! Yo! No, those are the ones that heal. They don't actually. 
I need air! Ow. Hope I'm going to die. No! I died. And there's another code! Yay! Let's keep going. Oh, I should just. Oh! Uh. So I'm slowly past eight arms. Uh, I'll remember to do that. I need you to go over here. I am a dolphin. I am smarter than you. And I'm pressing the wrong buttons again. Oh, air. You may not pass yet. Well, that's mean. I don't know why, but it feels like he ow, ow, ow the aims for those puffer fish. Ow! Going to hurry up and go. Oh. Okay. Where's my f air pocket? Right here. Eh. Got some air. And now. Yes, I know. Okay, do do do. Okay, I know I can't pass it, so I gotta go this way. Oh, remember what it said swim slowly past eight arms. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna go back and get some more air. Then I just gotta hope that there's a fish on the other side because eight arms is not nice. Okay, there's enemies over there, and I gotta get going. Oh, that's a mean one. Don't get that. I'm going to die. Unless I can get some air quickly. No, oh, come on. Oh, phew. Hopefully, there's fish on the other side of this. There's jellyfish. Grand.
Is there actually a... Nope, there is a glam. And I died running into the spikes. Yay me. And with that, I'll probably... Well, actually... I guess I'll give it one more try, since... Now I don't have to be like, Hey guys, look! You gotta do this, this, and this. Because... Yay. Ow. I still don't know why I don't get hurt by those. That means I have to push this thing again. Come on, Echo, you can do this. Uh, Echo stopped her big. Okay. Okay, here we go. We're free! Oh, yeah, go so fast. Eight arms. So it's just. Okay. In the next episode, we are definitely gonna get past that point because that was pretty much the end of this whole entire level. But of course, I'm derping like hell and just forgetting about old eight arms. AKA, he's an octopus. Octopuses suck. Gonna make calamari out of you. But, anyways, that'll be it for this episode. Leave a like, comment, subscribe down below, and hopefully we'll see more Echo. I will try to work on more... What is that game called? They Bleed Pixels is planned. I am actually getting a little bit tired of that game, so if you guys want me to stop doing that Let's Play, I will stop. If you don't, just let me know. I, I, I don't like being left in the dark. <laughs> And also, I will be continuing on Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm just lazy as hell and being like, I, I just expect too many things from that game, and I just it doesn't really scare me. And I also need to play Slender the Arrival just so then. Because if you see my friend Alice's channel, I was actually doing a live stream with her with Sunder Day Arrival, and it's really funny. I'll link it in the description below. And also, you get to see my favorite thing. You get to see me. You can see me without. Well, you can just see me. And then you can also see Zeno Plushie, which is a plushie that I had commissioned based on my character Zeno. So. Yeah. Well, everyone, Zeno out. You don't like control.